Welcome to another gorgeous summer, summer day here in Harvest Moon 64. And tomorrow will be sunny. Which is good, because today's rainy. Anyhow, I'm Color 40. Praise be to God on this amazing day, as always. Oh boy, our tomatoes are already starting to grow. Feed the birds. Toppins a bag. Toppins. Toppins. Toppins a bag. Alright. Carpenters should start work on the kitchen today. That'll be excellent. We need to make careful sh we need to make sure every time we wake up, no weeds have destroyed our crops. That would be bad. Well, I guess it's okay if they destroy one, but more than one, and we have a problem. Oh, that's right. Maria should be in her house because the library's closed. Oh, no. Don't tell me Maria's not around today when it's raining. That's sad. Hello, Ellie. Wow, that's helpful, thanks. Oh, music box? Nice sound. It sounds good to the ears. Wait, no, 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 I did not... I didn't want to do that. What, for me? Isn't it an important memento? Thank you. I'll take good care of it. Rest when you're tired, okay? So because I just gave her an egg, I don't think that actually increased her affection at all, which is annoying. And now I don't have a gift for Maria. Shoot. Oh, well, I'll give Granny, um, a walnut. Oh, thank you. Let me teach you how to bake a walnut cake. It's easy because you don't have to whisk. And we get the walnut cake recipe. Granny, I don't know what you're talking about. Whisking eggs is a cinch. So how's your new life? Okay, Jeff. You need to say more stuff. Well, great. Maria's not even going to be here today. Shoot. Oh, well. Our shop is closed on Sundays and festival days. I, I knew that. See ya, keep up the good work. Uh, hey, Basil. Might as well talk to him every day. Oh, no! I can't buy Moondrop seeds anymore? Are you kidding me? So I'm just stuck at a six-point card. That's so such baloney! You can plant those in summer! Why do they not sell them in... Duh. I don't like dark rainy days. I hope tomorrow will be nice. What the, what the heck? <laughs> Why did I buy all those flowers then? This, this is such baloney! Oh man, this is a bad day. I, Maria's not here. I gave the music box to Ellie by mistake. And I just learned I wasted a ton of money. Great! Worst day ever. Wow, thank you. I've heard of the door to heaven. That's the wine the old lady at the vineyard made. Anyway, you should ask the goddess about the details. If you throw an offering into the fountain, she will appear. At last. I'll do that tomorrow. I've already made a wish from the goddess today. Two would be greedy. I'm still really annoyed that they don't sell moondrop flowers after spring, because you can plant them in summer. So I don't think there are any ways for me to get more points on my card this year. Bah. I really wanted the first prize from the flower shop this year. It's not like a game ruining, but... It's very annoying. I'm going to go into the woods, pick a bunch of flowers, and give them to all my closest bar drinking buddies. I hope all my closest bar drinking buddies are there at the bar today. 
If it's just like, oh, it's Kai and Grey, that'll be annoying. I want Basil to show up. It would be cool if Cliff showed up, and pretty much any of the Bachelors. I want to say it's slightly shorter to do that. Maybe not. Hey everybody, Artie's ready to party. Wow, this is a terrible turnout. Literally, it's Karen and her father. Oh, thank you. I feel happy. That's wine my grandma made. How do you make such wine? Ugh, I don't know you and I don't want to know you. I'm rude, basically. Man, Regis, I'm sorry nobody came to your bar tonight. Well, yesterday was a bad day. Let's hope today's better. It's never fun learning that one of the things you were planning on getting later on in the year is impossible. But that's my own fault for not researching. Oh boy. My corn is growing as well. There you go, chickens. You can let your chickens outside and it'll automatically feed them, but then it's annoying to pick up all the eggs in the morning, so I don't do it. Yep, here are the carpenters. They're here to build my kitchen. Hey, dude. It's okay, just mind your own business. It's my kitchen. It is my business. Thinking of you during the hot season. Oh, that's so nice of Maria. Oh. Looks like she's totally crushing on me, just like vice versa. Hello, Anne. That brought you something. What is that for me? Thank you. You got a face animals would like. Well, thank, thanks, Anne. I hope that means I don't look like an animal. Hey, Gray. Here's your egg. Looks happy. That is the best way of increasing his affection. And I do really want to see the scenes between him and Poppery. It'll be great. Alright, I really hope Rick is out today. Basil must be in the woods. Cool. Hello, Ellie. Wow, that's helpful. Thanks. Eat sweets to re-energize when you get tired. You can eat between jobs. Uh, this isn't a scam like the flower shops is, is it? Yes! Thank goodness Rick has decided to be social today. Now let's see. Oh, that's right. Maria's always going to be in the woods during the first ten days of summer. Hey, Harris. You should check the mailbox every day. There are leaflets from the shops as well as letters. Oh, well, thanks for the advice, Harris. Here you go. Wow, thank you very much. I'm the nicest. Hey, it's Cliff. And hey, it's Stu. Do you know why seawater is salty? That's because God made it salty, Stu. Oh, thank you very much. Hi, Artie. Flowers are good, really. Yeah, you don't have to convince me of that. I like animals. Alright, I really should go and feed the goddess her daily egg. I don't want her to go hungry. Hi, have you gone fishing yet? Yes, I have. Barely, but I have. I've heard of the door to heaven. That's the wine the old lady at the vineyard made. Anyway, you should ask the goddess about the details. If you throw an offering into the fountain, she'll appear. Yeah, I like how they actually do give you the hint as to how to summon the goddess. It's not just like a how would you ever figure that out thing. Uh, the cicadas are being especially active today. And Maria's here, thank goodness. So once we do all of that... Oh, you're the spiritual person! What are you interested in today? Grape spirit. So this only appears if you have the door to heaven and the harvest sprites have noticed it. The spirit of the grapevine at the vineyard. You want to wake it up? Okay, let's go. Wait, what? Speak to it with your heart. Pray in your heart. What? 
I totally forgot it changes this it ends the day immediately if you do that. Doggone it! <laughs> I didn't talk to Maria. Who dares to disturb my sleep? I was having a good dream. You've been sleeping for twenty years. Isn't it about time you woke up? Please listen to what he has to say. Hmm? Okay, I understand. So the Kifu fairies also went somewhere, huh? I'm sorry about that. I'll go get them. Wait here. Today was a good day and I'm going to have a good sleep. Well, great! We couldn't give Maria the freaking music box! <laughs> oh my. Things are not going well. Two terrible days in a row. Wow. I am kind of tempted to reset that one, but you know what? No. I'll keep my old save state, but I'm not going to reset. Because you have to do that between the hours of 9am and 5pm. And it was getting close to 5pm. And I totally forgot about that. That was stupid old me. Oh well, it's Sunday, so... We can give Maria the music box today. And hey, my stuff's growing more. Tomatoes are getting quite nice. Sometimes, some days the birds will show up at your farm. I don't really think they have a purpose, but... It's cool anyways. Why didn't I talk to Maria first? Why? Okay, here's Maria. Oh, what a pretty music box. Has a wonderful sound, very soothing. It's a good thing I'm giving her a lot of music boxes. Time passes really quick, doesn't it? Yeah, it's almost like the in-game clock is different from the real-life clock. Hey, Maria, check it! I'm gonna wish for love. <laughs> the goddess is just going to manipulate Maria's affections right in front of her. That's a little... creepy. Of course Rick is in the square today, why not? Well, I don't have a broken music box, but I do have a flower for my main Basil. Boy, it's hot! Flowers need rain, too! Poppery is a bit of a father complex, though I think most girls have that. Thank you for telling me all of your family's deep personal secrets. Well, I mean... We got a lot of stamina since we got a lot of sleep yesterday, so might as well cut some lumber up in the top. Whew! Exhausting work. Even the bar's closed on Sunday. I mean, it makes sense since it's the Sabbath day and everything, but... Well, I mean, it's Christian Sabbath, and I'm pretty sure Christianity's not really a thing in this town, because they kind of worship, like, the Harvest Goddess? But, yeah, to each their own, I guess. It's kind of ambiguous. We're still at that point in summer where nothing is growing, so we don't really need to designate harvest days. Thank goodness for that. Oh yeah, I forgot about this scene. Hi Artie. I caught lots of fish this morning, so I came here to share with you. This happens if you, uh, Cliff is at a certain affection level. I thought this happened in spring, actually. Hey, thanks, man. Sorry for bothering you so early in the morning. See you later. Ouch, what? Sorry, but you should watch where you're going. What did you say? You don't look familiar. Are you a traveler? Hmm, what? Your name is Cliff? Is she supposed to say that to Cliff? Because she said that to me. <laughs> That, yeah, that's the first of the Cliff and effect, uh, affection scenes. Oh, hey, my kitchen's built, too. Sweet. Okay, everything interesting is happening today. Yeah, so this is my kitchen. 
It's like a whole second room to the house. So we've got a refrigerator. I said we got a refrigerator here. So we can put uh, perishable items in here. So we can't put flowers in there. But we can put any, like, food item in there, which is pretty cool. This is a list of the recipes we have. And then, this is a list of the power nuts we have. Received from the water sprite at the mountain pond. Received from the goddess of the spring. And purchased at the flower festival. We also had the anti-rain berry, but that's not listed on there. But yeah, that's really cool. We had two visitors in this morning. And here's the third. How about this? Isn't it great? I just finished. Take a look. I already have, guys. It looks amazing. Something tells me I need to be boosting Anne's affection a bit more. Once, once I start getting corn that's growing, it'll be a lot easier, because corn, like potatoes, boosts Anne's affection by a good amount. But until then, all we can really do are give her flowers, and those aren't very effective. Not for Anne, anyways. Can you imagine how long this would take if we didn't have the gold watering can? Even with the silver watering can, this would take, like, five times longer. I really need to find a new power nut soon. I'm just waiting for me to dig up one of the power nuts while looking for the music box. Hey, Basil! There you go. Huh. You know, it's kind of weird that you're giving me, a married man, <laughs> flowers every day right in front of my wife. It's a little weird. The memo says, Firefly Lights coming on the 16th. That's a little foreshadowing for the Firefly Festival. Alright, you know what? It's time for me to buy the brush. That's a brush. Cows, sheep, and horses alike when you brush them. You'll need one if you enter the cow contest, that's for sure. Price is 600G. Yep. Thank you very much. Should I buy this as well? Huh. Because right now, basically, I'm saving up for getting a cow, getting the greenhouse, and then I want some money in autumn when there's another horse race. Besides that, though, there's not a whole lot I want to spend money on, so yeah, why not? Room organizer. Organize your living space. Don't carry around items you don't need. Price, 2,000 two G. Never mind, I thought it was 1,000. Lots of good stuff, though, right? If by that you mean two fiends, then yes. Oh, hey, it's Jeff. I want to befriend Jeff as well. Oh, thank you. Hello, I'm here to fish, but I haven't caught anything yet. When I'm tired, I drink a cup of tea. It warms and refreshes my body and spirit. You and your tea. That guy just loves his tea. So Ellie should be... Nope. Well, that's right. I know where Ellie's going to be today. Yeah, Ellie will be at the beach every Monday when it's summer, provided... I'm all full on stuff. I didn't think that was going to be the case. Oh, that's right, because I didn't throw anything in the goddess pond, stupid old myself. Whoops. Well, I threw away a priceless jewel, so... Okay, wow, apparently you have to throw it from the bridge. Yep, Ellie's at the dock. Fisherman's here, too. Wow. Wow, that's helpful. Thanks. My dad's grilled fish tastes, tasted so good. I have gone fishing yet? Well, life is long. We should live with a little slack. Dude, your life is slack. Rest when you're tired, okay? Where's my horse? There he is. Yeah, we can show off the brush here. That'll also boost its affection once per day. Pretty useful. I think we have time for one more day. Maybe two. So now we can get into our new routine of whistling for our horse, brushing it, and then jumping on it every morning. Bam. Biggest affection boost. Oh boy! Our tomatoes are about to grow fully. I really hope I get Maria up to a pink heart soon. Because I think the deadline might be... 25th of summer. We need to get her up there before the 25th of summer. Because if we don't get her by a to a pink heart by then, 
We're not going to get the best birthday present for her from her. That worries me a little. Hey, Ellie. Here you go. Wow, that's helpful, thanks. I like fish much better than meat, and it's more nutritious. Fish is meat! <laughs> is that the number mistranslation, apparently? Or does she just not consider fish to be meat? And she's at a green heart now. Rest when you're tired, okay? So how's your new life? Dude, you need a new catchphrase. Come on. <laughs> Well, Maria's gonna be back in the library soon, but until then, she'll always be in the woods. Dude, I'm well aware of that the music box is a love song. It's not like I haven't buried 30 of them by now. How did Jack get all these music boxes as a little kid? It really is astounding. Well, Basil's not here today, that's a bummer. Maria's still here, cool. Hello, goddess. Grant me my wish, please. Well, hello, what will it be? It's love. It's always going to be love. At least until we get a bit later in the game. Hey, Maria. Oh, she's at a yellow heart now. Sweet! Okay, that's good. We should be able to get her to her p a pink heart, no problem now. Time passes really quick, doesn't it? Alright. I thought she was still going to be at a green heart for a while, but now that she's at a yellow heart, I'm not worried. Especially because now that she's a yellow heart, we'll get a lot of special scenes between us. Which will boost her affection even more. So getting her from a ye getting any girl from a yellow heart to a pink heart... Really easy. Provided you know what to do. I'm coming, Basil! <laughs> Men remain boys no matter how old they get. Always dreaming. Again, I do want to say it is a little weird that I'm going out of my way to give a married man flowers every day. But I need that power nut! <laughs> Hello! Oh, don't leave! No! Why? You idiot, Zack. Why would you do that? I don't think we're gonna get that scene again. Darn it! She made a cake for me! Yeah, because Ellie was at a green heart, she came by my farm. And because it turned 5 o'clock and Zack had to come on screen, she left! Curse you, Zack. This is all today's shipment. I'm taking it, okay? Yay! <laughs> oh, man. This has just not been my episode, apparently. I really hope we do get that Ellie scene again. Because we didn't talk to her, but at the same time, she came to the farm and then left. And again, this game is not super well programmed, so I would not be all surprised if we miss out on that scene. It's not super important, she just gives us a cake and it boosts her affection a little bit to see it. Oh, I'm so mad at all the bad stuff that's been happening to me this episode. Take this to your table. Alright. That's gonna do it for this episode. I That's all I can take for now. Hopefully this isn't a super bad episode, but a lot of interesting stuff did happen. It's just most of it happened to be negative. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. I hope to see you for the next episode. We'll be going to the first festival in summer, definitely. Hopefully we can get uh, see a few special scenes with Maria. And hopefully we can get that Ellie scene again. I'll hope to see you then. Have a great day and God bless.